welcome back to my channel. I am doing one of my favorite things I love to do around this season. It is currently, what is today? November 11th, national, well, okay. first what we're doing is we're packing our boxes for Operation Christmas Child. So Samaritan's Purse runs this um, program every year. They have stuff you can donate throughout the year, but um, really the big thing that they push is the Operation Christmas Child, a whole bunch of churches get involved. Um, and so basically, you have these boxes. Um, we're going to do two today. And then they, it will show you inside, there's usually a pamphlet that says how to pack the shoe box. And basically, you'll have a label. You can pick boy or girl, two to four years old, five to nine years old, 10 to 14 years old. And then you will cut that out and place it on your box, turn it into any uh, drop-off location that you have. My church is a drop-off location, so we are going to just drop them off there. And then you donate $9 to help with shipping, but if you want to donate a few more dollars, they'll also do... Um, sorry, I was looking they'll also include a Bible lesson. So I think $15 per box, but we're gonna go through what I've bought for each box. Uh, I'm gonna do a boy and a girl, and I think, based on what I got, I think my boy is gonna be the five to nine years old, and then my girl is gonna be probably 10 to 14. Yeah, I think we'll do 10 to 14 for her. So, um, I've been shopping here and there. Today we went to Dollar Tree and got a lot more of this stuff. Um, I might get a few more things for the boy, but we'll see once I pack everything and if I have space. <laughs> um, first things first, I, for each of them, got them both floss and toothbrushes. Um, no toothpaste because they also have like list of things that they don't want you to include, so... Don't include candy, toothpaste, gum, used or damaged items, war-related items, seeds, food, liquids, lotions, medications, vitamins, breakable items, or glass containers. So I that's why I don't get them toothpaste. But inside the little pamphlet, they also give you like gift ideas. And one of them um, is, or like they have a wow item, toys, personal care items, school supplies, accessories. So like I said, I probably will add a few more things and this is just ideas to help you. Not required, just ideas. Okay, so floss and toothbrush for both of them. I got them two, uh, like a double, double pack. Then pencils and a pencil sharpener. And then they each got a notebook, so. I got their pencil sharpener to match their notebook, so like the blue, and apparently I switched them up. So this is the boys' box, and this is the girls. And red with red pencil sharpener and then the pencils. So that will go in there. Then I each, I got them both some chapstick. My brain's not working, okay. Uh, for the boys, let me switch these. For the boys box, I got him two Hot Wheel cars, a blue race car and a red race car. I got him a little bag. Um, I just thought it was cute and I can roll it up and make it fit pretty easily. I got him a hair styling kit, so basically it just comes with a styling brush and a comb. I got him some band-aids. I got him a bar of soap. There was like a two-pack so I just split it up. So there was like one for her, one for him. I got him a inflatable globe. I thought either he could play with this or he could use it to learn about the world. And then I also got them pins. I'm going to split four and four. 
and then I got a water bottle. So what I'll do with the pens is put them in there, save a little bit of space. And then I also got us some stickers to split among the two. So we'll do, we'll do that. And then I got him a little frog. Um, stuffed animal is very soft. Um, so that will go in his box. In her box, um, what I already showed you, and then I got her band-aids and soap, like I had in his. I got her a comb and a brush as well, color purple. I got her some stretch lace and some beads. So if she wanted to make bracelets or hair ties or something, she can do that. Give her a little craft to do. I got her a scarf. I thought it was pretty. She could wear it on her head, around her face, like around her neck, whatever. There's a lot of options. I got her a little bag as well. Um, just something to carry, put her stuff in. And then also can fold that up pretty easily and put that in there. I got her a puzzle, 500 piece puzzle. Got this really cool, pretty flower design on it. Um, also got her a globe inflatable globe, a little blue teddy bear, and then a water bottle as well. So I will put all this stuff in the box. I think one of the other things I really like to do is make sure that I, um, or is I like to fit everything in there and then I'm like, can I fit more? Do I want to fit more? <laughs> um, but yeah, so I will show you the boxes after I am done packing them. are packed I'm going to cut the labels you can also choose to donate online and then um, follow oh okay you can do this you can do it two ways to donate and follow your box to figure out like or just to see where it ends up you can scan the QR code that's on the label or you can enter the dying digit code beneath at the samaritanfirst.org slash activate um, another thing that you can do is like pay online and then print out a QR code and then they will send you updates about the box as far as like where it ends up. Um, National Collection Week is November 15th through the 22nd. So like I said, um, Collection Week is next week, but they usually start packing the boxes like the week before or two weeks before or just whatever. Um, if you're interested, I'll put some information down below. Thank you for joining me. Like I said, this is one of my favorite things I do um, all year or around the Christmas season especially. Um, it's just nice to send something to a kid who doesn't have very much. And that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you for joining me and I will see you guys next time. Bye!